Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to import M4A files and other files to Audacity. First, obviously, you want to go to audacity.sourceforge.net to download Audacity. Now you want to click Download. Audacity Installer. Save file and wait for it to download. Once it's done, you want to double click it to open the installer, run it, click yes, choose your language, click OK, next, 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 install, finish. Audacity should launch. If not, then open Audacity. Go to Edit, Preferences, and go to the Library section. You need LAME and FFmpeg in order to play M4A files. So what you want to do is download both add-ons. First, you want to download LAME. You want to click Download, and a window should pop up on your browser. Now you want to go to the LAME download page, scroll down, then click Download for Windows. Save file, then wait for it to download. I promise you this is virus free. Now you want to double click and run it, click yes. and install the setup wizard. Accept, next, and browse. You want to browse to find the Audacity folder. You want to go up to Audacity and then click on it and click OK. Next, install, finish. Go to Audacity and click OK, exit, and then reopen it. You want to go to Preferences again in Library, and you should see that LAME and the version is um, successfully downloaded. It should say LAME and the version here. If you can't find it, then you can locate it. Now to download FFmpeg, it's basically the same steps as the lame mp3 except it's a different add-on. You want to click download again and a window should pop up again and you want to click download the ffmpeg installer, save the file, double click to run, click run and then yes again. Now another wizard should come up, next, accept, next, and you want to browse for the folder again, go find Audacity and click OK. Click next, install, finish. Now go to Audacity, exit Now you want to go to edit and then preferences again. You should see that both lame and, and FFmpeg is installed. If you don't have FFmpeg you can locate it. Uh, I don't really know what this is but I already have it so click OK and now you can successfully play M4A and other files on Audacity. Now, you can't hear it, but I promise you it works. So, 